Oh boy, it's the last video before I move into a new location, oh boy. I can't believe media was actually about Boink the whole time. One. One possible interpretation. Yep. Two. Literally the main theme. And three. Worst take you've ever seen in your life. Can you guess which fandoms get infected by number three? Velna, your nose's nose like nobody knows. This is the best compliment my art could possibly get. Notes. All of my notes for this story disappeared from my phone, irretrievably. I'm being so incredibly brave about it. You wouldn't believe how brave I am right now. It's actually incredible. <laughs> Why do you people love rubbing buzz cuts so much? Nice texture. Fuzzy. It's like velvet that doesn't hate you. Like petting short hair dog. I am learning so much. My friend got a tattoo on his arm that says, Comparison is the thief of joy. And I'm really debating getting the same tattoo on my arm, but just a little bit bigger. And then someone walks up to both of them like, wow, this is just like Steven Universe. And then they both are like, we don't want our arms anymore. Just, just take them off. My roommate moved out and my cat called Dibs. <laughs> this is going to be piff as soon as I leave. Neurodivergent or handy culture is either forgetting things three minutes later after they told you or having something you remember every single day, even though it happened seven years ago. There is no in-between. And it's usually traumatic. Big issue with linear time is that when there are a few minutes until some event and there aren't enough minutes to do anything with, you just, you just lose those minutes. I think you should be able to save them for later and then combine them into a chunk of leftover time that you get to use at the end of the day. Like bonus hours. Wait. Million dollar young adults novel idea. The hero saves all those chunks at times and uses it to prevent their own death. I love how overthrowing the government is a crime. Like, what are you gonna do? Get law enforcement after me? <laughs> My sibling in Christ, I own the law enforcement now. Some woman on the street below just hit an operatic high C and then screamed, I'll fucking kick your ass. That was the wardrobe from Beauty and the Beast. Hey, Sid the Avenger? This post has over 50,000 notes. People have added on that the woman on the street below was Brendan Yuri, Christine Day, Christian Kenoweth, Roger Taylor, Star Kid, literally me, and literally you. And this is the only valid addition. Andy, give him a gold star. They did it. Please stop framing me for murder. Just because I've killed 1,846 people doesn't mean I killed that specific one. Man, this is a staring from Baldur's Gate 3, I swear to God. Oh no, it's Jeff, the mild inconveniencer. Sure hope he doesn't do anything stupid to the video. Woke Agenda killed my son. They came down and killed him with rocks. They bashed him with rocks. <laughs> <laughs> Would you say, Pucky? Would you say that the Woke Agenda <laughs> put your son to sleep? Teachers be like, what inspired you to write this essay? Bro, the, the deadline. I've started saying I no longer wish to be vertical when my legs are tired and I want to sit down. It's a good way, don't it? I have invented a new game. I call it Stick Wars. To start, everyone is together in one place, then everyone splits up to look for these sticks, and after a set amount of time, everyone meets back up. Oh. God damn it, Jeff.